My beloved brothers and sisters, you and I know that Musa alayhi salam or the Prophet Moses, may peace be upon him, was one of the greatest of the Prophets of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, one of the top five. And Allah Almighty makes mention of his name the most in the Quran from among the messengers. The fact that his name has been mentioned the most does not elevate his status beyond that of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Because your name being mentioned in the Quran, or should I say a name being mentioned in the Quran, does not necessarily mean that it is depictive of its value based on how many times it is mentioned. And the reason I say this is there are people who are saying that Jesus, may peace be upon him, has a higher status in prophethood than Muhammad sallallahu because he was mentioned more times in the Quran and that is not true. It's got nothing to do with how many times you were mentioned. The Prophet sallallahu the Quran was revealed to him. So if the Quran was revealed to him, it is natural that his name won't appear in the Quran as many times as other messengers whose stories were repeated in the Quran. Another thing is, if value was added to the number of times someone was mentioned in the Quran, then the Pharaoh or Fir'aun is mentioned in the Quran so many times. What value did he have? Nothing at all. It was reverse value. Shaitan, Iblis is mentioned several times in the Quran. So let's get this straight. How many times your name or a name is mentioned in the Quran is not indicative of its value in the, in the eyes of Allah Almighty. We believe that Afdalul Khalqi wa Akramul Rusuli is Nabi Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. What that means is the greatest of creation, the most noble of all prophets of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. 